Hey guys, me and Tess. Oh, my mom. Hi. Yep. And we just got a uh, Miss uh, Peregrine's uh, Home for Peculiar Children. Yeah, Miss Peregrine Home uh, for Peculiar Children. Peculiar Children. Yeah, it's, 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 yeah, it's a hard, hard tired to announce. Um, directed by Tim Burton. Mm -hmm. Um, so Asa Butterfield. Um, yeah, uh, Asa Butterfield, Judy Dench. Judy Dench. Um, oh my God, what's the girl from Penny Dreadful? The girl from Penny Dreadful. Yeah, Penny Dreadful. Um, Sammy had the main villain. Samuel L. Yeah, Jackson. Yeah, he was awesome as always. Um, and, um, oh, you know who was in it? What's his name? Um, Rupert, Rupert Everett? Yeah. I haven't seen him since, like, 19,000 years ago. Is he still yeah. doing movies? I think, I think he is still doing movies. I don't know. Did they have, like, a fake nose on him or something? No. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Anyway, um, basic plot. Uh, you at the book, so you know. No, I'm in the middle of reading the book, and this is my problem. I'm reading the book for my book club, and for some unknown reason, I decided that, wow, I really want to see the movie because I want to see how different it is, and uh, yeah. yeah, it's quite different, and I'm actually in really enjoying the book, and I'm sort of pissed off about this movie, Yeah, uh, but uh, anyway, so basic plot, yeah, wait, oh, so, so yeah, a bunch of peculiar children um, are in like an orphanage in Wales, yeah, orphanage in Wales, that's even 19, 43, yeah, 43, and... It's kind uh, of a time travel it, thing. It's time travel. It, it's, it's, a, too yeah, it's too confusing. Yeah, it's too confusing to explain. It wasn't too much spoilers. But, um, short version is, it's very good at the, but they got to go back in time and try to yes, save the children yeah. from the main events. The same as the kids. That's the big plot. In a nutshell, I can do much, too much spoilers. Now, going into this movie, I know what to expect because the trailer, the trailer get, did this movie no justice because when I saw the trailer, I thought it looked great. Like, something I, I seen before, like, some other movies, and I've seen the movie, this is a really fun movie. I know what the critic is smoking, because this movie is fun. Is it perfect? No. But no, I guess it's one of Tim Burton's best movies that he's been making for a decade, because last Tim Burton I saw was, uh, that was a one Oh. Uh, uh, 2010. Oh, Lord. I'm what? still trying to get over that. Yeah. Do it. Do it. say about that movie the best. Uh, anyways, um. This movie on the other end, it's much more funner. It does have some creepy moments. Yeah, there were points in it though where I was kind of wishing the whole movie would end. And this can be because, like an idiot, I've been reading the book. So honestly, my recommendation would be to read this book. Or don't and see the movie. You gotta yeah. pick one because it's yeah. too... It, it's... The book is so much better that I think you'd be disappointed in the movie. I'll just yeah. put it that way. Um, yeah, I, I never read the book in reality because, um, one, I barely read my books. And two, at the, um, for I heard, the book is far better. Wait, what you doing? Yeah, me? yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, the book is definitely much better. Yeah, but as an adaptation, as a teacher, I think this is the big premise of it, and they basically do their own story. I'm still waiting yeah. for a Tim Burton movie that I like. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. I've, like, decided now, right this second, that I don't like Tim Burton, and he disappoints me every single time. And quite frankly, all of his movies are, like, similar. You always have these, like, kind of, like... Uh, dark. Well, no, the dark, skeleton-y characters from, like, The Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah. It's just, like, never-ending. Like, Tim, come up with something new and original already. Yeah. And I think he did try that. Maybe he tried that with... The uh, Planet of the Apes, and that was like an epic fail. Yeah, exactly, that was a, that was a remake. Right. So, and like, even that, he can't do something new. Like, it's time. Well, here's the thing about Planet of the Apes. Planet of the Apes, that remake, even though it was a horrible, horrible, horrible remake and, and, and it's like quite nice, I'll give that that movie credit. The product of Fairground and the movie were good. But anyway, that, this is a different topic. But here's my thoughts. All I had to do about the movie was doing fun. Samuel Jackson, made man, he was awesome. Like, he was very, very creepy. But you didn't think that Samuel yeah. Jackson played, like, yet again, the same Samuel Jackson character? But in this well, time, a scary Yeah, but he's, he's more than a villain. Like, yeah, he was, was a villain, but he, he was, like, in his usual, like, Samuel Jackson rant. True. True, yeah, yeah. But you just... It was funny. But, was, you, you can make his own fun. Yeah, he did He did make the scary person fun. I will give yeah, him that. Right. But it was still Samuel L. Jackson in his Samuel L. Jackson-ness once again. Well, yeah, but he didn't... Um, I, I think he's not fun with scary. Like, I, I have to laugh, 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 laugh with him because you know he's a complete like, psychopath in the movie, Joe. Mm -hmm. He's not even fun. And that's the one that's 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 I liked him. He's great. Um, all the other cats were great, too. Like, um, well, like I said... This movie is not perfect, right? No flaws with no time travel story. Time travel 
Which we could make a point five an egg. Thank you, Looper. But if, yeah. if you suspend your disbelief... Yeah, I'm still oh, trying to understand Looper, but okay. Yeah, yeah. you have a point. Uh, suspend yeah, your disbelief in your eyes, you're your movie guys. You're like, time travel stories are always confusing. But this movie, oh, actually, I, think, I think it did time travel right, right, right. Sort of. Right, mm -hmm. you still have to suspend your disbelief in life, but you know what? If you, right, ignore that and actually enjoy what it is, it, you can enjoy it. Um... Yeah, because Cameron went with her three friends, and they loved it. Yeah. And I honestly believe this to be true. If I never read any part of this book, then I think I would have enjoyed it more. Yeah. But because I've been, I'm, like, halfway in this book, and, like, I told you a total loser decided to, like, see this movie, that's a huge mistake. So I honestly believe, in my heart, you have to make a decision. Yeah. Either yeah. see the movie first... Then and read the book. then read the book, or vice versa. But don't, or or I actually think if you read the book, you're gonna be disappointed in the yeah. movie. But I think you, if you haven't read the book, just go see the movie and have fun with it. Yeah. Um. And for me, you know, I, I didn't read the book, so I recommend you see me. And we should probably get pop bots because um, mm -hmm. we're running out of it's topics. It's getting long. Okay. Yeah. Anyways, so, um, my bots. Um, do I like my in theaters? I say yes because it's a movie out there I do like and I do want to see more out there of this world. Because I think there is going to be another one. Yeah, I'm hoping this movie might make my budget back so we've got a sequel. And um, if you don't want to see it, that's fine. You can see another movie, but appreciate it, movie. I want a sequel because the story is very interesting. Anyway, I'll, I'll give my rating. I give. Eh. Drum roll. Drum roll. This. Oh, what do you give it? Um, a four out of five stars. Oh my. God. Actually, no, wait, you know, you know what? Uh, I'll, I'll go with um, 3.5 stars. Okay, I'm yeah. going with two stars. That's right, two. That's just how yeah. I feel. Um, so we're 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 a little bit, we have a big wedge between yeah. us for this one. But that's yeah. okay. Yeah, we agree. At the end of the day, we all have our opinions. Um, yeah. Wait, that's our view on the... It's, our, it's Peregrine's it's home Peregrine, <laughs> for um, Peculiar it, Children. It, it, it's very hard to have that. Like, it's... A, it's yeah. Anyways, um, that's a review of Miss Peregrine's Home Peregrine's for Peculiar Home, Children. Children. And, um, please comment on what you think about the movie. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Also, I can feed people on Twitter. And please don't subscribe to my channel. Until tomorrow, peace. Oh, peace. Bye.